hello welcome back to my channel if you are new here don't forget to click on the button to like my page and also to subscribe to my button yeah it's bj here yeah. to those that know me before the news that i'm bj so now i'm going to teach you how you can work on your logo on corridor i'm using corridor x7 you can see it over here i'm using corridor x7 so now this tutorial that i'm creating for you guys right now it's not for those that are experts it's for those that are just learning it that you don't really know anything about logo because logo i'm going to create for you now is very very simple so just not for experts just for beginners so i pick my circle tools for you from here and also you can also press f7 direct to pick your circle tool over here can you see it down here so now just click on p it will jump into the middle of my page over here to jump into the middle of my page over here so now the next thing you want to create a logo for pepsi you can mind now ah i would like to do that but it is very very simple so now the first thing is my circle over here and the second thing is to just come here over here just click on your free and two f5 here just click on and pick 2.9 over here then you come to edge i hope you know the middle of i'll be quadrant quadrant over here then you what quadrant again and leave it like that, that way i hope you understand what i'm doing right now the next thing is to just come here the next thing is to just come here like this you understand what i'm doing right now over here then you can come to your shape to over here or you click on f10 or you just come direct so you understand your shape to over here then you click tab it at the middle then you come here to pick a convert to curve and convert it to curve then you just do what try to adjust over here you want to create a logo for pepsi pepsi logo rather you know their logo very well so like this over there you can just Pull it up a little bit and this down a little bit then when you are done you can just click click on your space button or you come here to pick your pick to over here then you do what you make a duplicate of this by come by pressing ctrl ctrl c then you want ctrl v to copy it down over there or or you just do what press click on ctrl d direct to get it you understand what i'm trying to do over there so now the next thing is to just pick my color over here then i think they are all their color for this place is blue i think this place is also blue and then that place is red i mean make sense i think that's the color no 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 is that a color i think abby do i get it i think this place is white i don't really know i don't really know but since i've forgotten their um color over there i think this place is red i think this place is red wait i'm coming since this place is red over here then blue down here i think i hope you are making sense over here then you can just do what you can just do what come here then you know outline I think this is making sense wow i really love this <laughs> wow wow interesting so now don't for i have a lot of video on photoshop i do make a video a lot on photoshop i don't this is my first time of doing corridor so just people have been asking me to just do it story on corridor for people to understand you understand what i'm saying so if you want me to continue this you can just give it a like and also subscribe to my channel don't forget to share this video you know there are some people outside there that also want to learn this also so it's bj yeah bye